Hello, this is Clint Locklear from the Farmer Grove. I'm out at uh, some really cool biomass. You see some of the, the wheat and oats and hairy vetch and uh, red clover. We've had a big rain here lately and it's just loving it. And I, I just did a video showing this a little bit and I was talking about protecting your trees. Here's another one of the Asian pears that is uh, <coughs> about to get eaten by the hairy vetch. So, what you're going to do with this, just pull it back. Let the sunlight get to it. And check on them about every three or four days. Because when you get a lot of rain, springtime, with, with cover crops like this, stuff will get out of control. I don't want to just whack all this down. Now, when I mulch this, I'll put a ring around this whole thing right here. But I'll leave the cover crops until they turn brown because I want to let them go all the way till they're brown so they're fungal food instead of bacteria. But protect those seedlings when you have them out. And for some reason, the oats and stuff are doing better over here. So these, these little Asian pears are doing very well. And the, these trees right in front of me that are kind of spindly i just put these in this year these are black ice plums and i'm gonna let that cover crop do whatever it wants to do around those trees because it can't eat them because they're as tall as i am but it's going to make for some something this place has needed for a long time and that's to get some fertility back in this soil